Good morning. Thanks for joining us for the News 12 Fastcast. I'm Nick Proto. It's 730 here on our Monday, October 14th. Today, the Aiken County Public School District is on a two hour delay for safety reasons. Everybody was on fall break in Aiken County when Helene hit the CSRA. Now as they head back to class, there's a slight change to the bus routes in North Augusta. The district posted on Facebook last night saying the current conditions in the Hammond Hills neighborhood have raised significant safety issues for students walking to school or walking to the bus stop and for the school buses traveling due to low hanging power lines, fallen trees and debris. Because there are several streets that serve Paul Knox Middle School and North Augusta High School students and cannot be accessed safely, those stops are being combined with the closest accessible stop. Previous stops at Stanton Drive and Brooks Drive and Stanton Drive and Hastings Place are being combined to one stop at Hammond Drive and Stanton Drive. The previous stop at Medi Avenue and Indian Mound Drive will now be combined with the stop at Riverview Drive and Medi Avenue and the previous stops at West Woodlawn Avenue and Dunbarton Drive. Also, 986 and 971 Campbellton Drive will be combined to the stop at Amherst Drive and West Woodlawn Avenue. That's a lot of confusing stuff right there. I know just check out the website for more information. The district says families living in the Hammond Hills neighborhood are strongly encouraged to accompany their child on their walk to school or to the bus stop or they arrange alternative transportation for them until the situation improves. We know Edgefield, Saluda, Jenkins and Tolliver counties head back to the classroom today. Columbia, Glasscock, McDuffie, Orangeburg and Warren counties have off today, but those are not storm related uh, off days and they head back tomorrow. Richmond and Jefferson counties are going back on Wednesday. Burke County goes back next week after their fall break.